Hey guys. Welcome to Freak Motion. Today we are going to create these. Alright. Let's create a composition with full HD settings as usual. Set the duration to 8 seconds and background color to white. First, take the rectangle tool and create a shape like this. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus Home button to center the anchor point, or you can use the pan behind tool to center the anchor point. Align it to the center. Now, open Transform, go to 30 seconds forward and add a keyframe on the scale. Then come back to first frame and set the scale value to zero. Easy ease both keyframe by hitting F9 and change the graph just like this. Now, open Rectangle Path 1 and increase the roundness value according to your need. Our first step is done. Now take the Type tool and type your text. Align it to the center and adjust the size according to your need. Change the color to white. Now select the text layer, take rectangle tool and create a shape like this. Now click on this animate button and select position. Go to 1 second and set a keyframe on position. Then come back to 30 frames and drag the text just like this. Easy ease the keyframes and change the graph the same as before. Nice. Again click on this animate button and select tracking. Now add a keyframe on tracking, then go forward to a few frames and set the tracking value to 6. Easy ease these keyframes and change the graph something like this. It looks good to me. Now go to 1 second and 30 frames and set a keyframe on the source text. Then go forward to 30 frames and change the text. Just like this. Now select the text layer and press S to open scale. Set a keyframe on the scale then go forward to 30 frames and scale it down a little bit. Then select these keyframes and change it to toggle hold keyframe. After all, animation should look like this. Now select this shape layer, open fill 1, and set a keyframe on color, then go forward to 30 frames and change the color to dark gray. Select both keyframes and change them to toggle hold keyframe. By doing this, the color will be changed to gray after 30 frames at a glance. I hope you understand. Alright. I have a vector file of the bell icon, and I am going to use it in this project. Drag it to our timeline, and adjust its position. Now go to 2 seconds and 30 frames and set a keyframe on position. Then come back to 2 seconds and drag the shape just like this. Easy ease the keyframes and change the graph something like this.
go to 2 seconds and 45 frames. Now select this layer and search for fill effects. Double click to apply it. Let's set a keyframe on color and change the color to gray. Then go forward to a few frames and change the color to yellow. Select these keyframes and change them to toggle hold keyframes. Make sure you place the marker at the last keyframe. Then open the bell icon composition. Select both sides of bell icon and add a keyframe on the position at the same frame. Then come back to a few frames and drag both shapes just like this. Select all keyframes and hit F9 to easy ease them. Nice. Now, go back to our main composition and you can see the changes here. Cool. Now it's time to reverse the whole process. Select these layers and press U to see all keyframes. Now copy these keyframes and paste it on 4 seconds. Then right click and select Time Reverse Layer. For this layer, I will suggest you to trim the unused portion. By doing these it will automatically vanish at the end of the last keyframe. Now copy all these keyframes and paste it here. And change it to time reverse keyframe. Now select shape layer, go to almost 6 seconds and set a keyframe on the scale. Then go forward to a few frames and change the scale value to 0. Our basic subscribe animation is done here. But you know, I always think something different. So I add a small animation regarding your channel name. It's a simple animation and I know, if you guys following my all videos, it will be a piece of cake for you. So I don't want to waste your time explaining these. I am fast forwarding these portion and I know you guys still understand what I did here. I trust you guys. If you face any problem, feels free to ask in comments. And also you guys can suggest me what type of video I should make in future for you. You can add some music when the color changes as I show you in the preview. I am providing all the files in the description. Subscribe button using a pointer icon is old, use this method. Let's wrap up for today. And always try to think outside the box. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give a thumbs up. And if you really want these kinds of cool tutorials then hit the subscribe button. See you guys in the next video. Signing out. Peace.